is hot with temperatures in the triple digits. Things are not only heating up for us, but also for fire crews. A brush fire broke out this morning near Shoshone and in just a few hours grew to a few thousand acres. Currently, the drop fire is estimated at 3000 acres. It's threatening structures, though fire officials say the town of Shoshone is safe. No evacuations have been ordered. However, the weather conditions have made things very challenging for our firefighters there. Misty Inglet has that story. The drops fire near Shoshone was first reported around 10 a.m. Friday morning. By late afternoon, the number of acres burned was already in the thousands. It's been pretty high activity all day. The biggest drivers behind the fire have been high winds and temperatures over 100 degrees. Firefighters are also dealing with tough terrain, making access a challenge. There's definitely quite a bit of sagebrush out there, which is burning pretty hot. It is also in our one of our lava flows. So there's a lot of lava humps and a lot of lava rock out there, which is making access extremely difficult for our firefighters. The engines are going about as far as they can, and then they're having to use hand tools. That means it's slow going for ground crews. So to help get a handle on the fire, air support was brought in, including multiple air tankers and helicopters. More than a dozen engines and crews from at least eight different agencies are working on the fire. Several rural fire districts are helping with structure protection in the area, but the Bureau of Land Management says the fire is burning away from town. There's definitely areas of concern and there are structures that are being threatened, but the, at, at this point, the town of Shoshone is, is looking pretty good. As winds continue to shift and temperatures remain high, BLM is asking you to avoid the area. We understand that it's really interesting to watch and it, you know, people like to see what's going on, but we are asking the public to stay away. In Boise, Misty Inglet, Idaho's News Channel 7. Now, BLM does not know when that fire will be contained. The cause still under investigation right now. Currently, the only road closures are some of the nearby dirt roads that go to public lands. Those are being used by fire crews to access the fire. You can find the latest updates on this and other fires right now on our website. At